fingering groups and singing along of 12 versus 15 major scales. Lesson two: single sound system for all musical accidentals. Lesson one has introduced the four fingering groups for all twelve major scales. If we can sing along while practicing the scales, our musical senses will improve. However, because it takes much longer time to sing a sharp or a flat note than a natural note, it is hard to sing along unless you change the notes into do re mi fa sol la ti do. Then you lose the direct one-on-one -on -one correlation between the staff notes and the names, as well as between the names and the piano keys. I want a single sound system for each musical note. Meanwhile, I want each single sound to maintain its direct relationship with each note on the staff. Each single sound of the accidentals should reflect its root, its corresponding natural note, of course. In addition, sharp note sounds should indicate they are sharp notes. Flat note sounds indicate they are flat notes. Double sharp note sounds for double sharp notes. Double flat note sounds for double flat notes. When you hear them, you will know immediately what they are. In other words, those sounds should be distinctive groups. Furthermore, the sounds should all be easy to say for English speakers as well as for many other languages. All of this together seem impossible, right? Well, sometimes when the idea is right, an inspiration comes. A simple solution can magically solve the problem of the world. The next three minutes are about this single sound system. No matter whether you feel theoretical issues are dry or you believe theories are the foundations of practices, I trust you won't regret to stay because every wish on the list will be satisfied. To maintain each single sound's direct relationship with each note on the staff, let's keep their names the same for all major and minor scales without any changes. To show the root note of each accidental note, let's keep the beginning sound of each natural note. Natural notes C, D, F, G, B all have corresponding consonant sounds such as s for C, d for D, etc. Note E, which is a vowel, also has a corresponding consonant E spelled as Y. The only exception is the note A. To make the names of accidental notes distinctively different from the natural notes, we can search vowel sounds that have not been used by the natural note names, such as a, uh, i, u, w, n, ang, and so on. And we can let the sharp notes. Flat notes, double sharp notes, double flat notes, like each group notes, rhyme with a vowel sound that is distinctively different from the natural note sound, and also distinctively different from another group notes. It's not hard to find abundant vowel sounds that are easy to pronounce in many languages, as long as we pay attention to this. The single sound system I made last year considered these four points. However, while using it, I felt the linkage among A sharp, A flat, and the natural note A are not obvious enough. I updated the system to make all vowel sounds of the accidental notes to start with the sound of A, such as I, ah, an, and an. This makes the relationship of all accidental notes to their natural notes very clear. So here is the updated version. All sharp notes rhyme with I. C sharp is I. D sharp is Di. F sharp is Fi. E sharp is Yi. G sharp is Gai. A sharp is I. B sharp is Bi. All flat notes rhyme with An. C flat San. D flat Dan. E flat Yan. F flat Fan. G flat Gan. A flat An. B flat Ban. All double sharp notes rhyme with A. C double sharp sa, D double sharp da, E double sharp ya, F double sharp fa, G double sharp ga, A double sharp a, B double sharp ba. All double flat notes rhyme with sang, which in Chinese is a n g, but in English o n g. C double flat sang, D double flat dang, E double flat yang, F double flat fang, G double flat gang, A double flat ang, B double flat bang.
This single sound system distinctively differentiated each accidental group notes from the other group notes, as well as from the natural notes. At the same time, they maintain direct and one-on-one -on -one relationship with the music notes on the staff. This system enables singing along and effective communications. Starting in the next lesson, I will analyze the fingering of each major scale in detail and sing along. I will play one, two, and four octaves. Since the circle fifth labeled three inharmonic pairs, I will play and sing all 15 major scales. Thanks for watching, commenting, thumbs up, and subscribing.